Chef Leander, and this is Small Kitchen Big Taste. We're right in the middle of the summer harvest, and there are all kinds of things available. One of the things I like to do is be able to save them for the winter months so that we can have some of that bounty at Thanksgiving and at Christmas. And one of my favorite ways to do that is with compound butters. Now that sounds like a really fancy term. Basically what it means is any buttering that has a natural flavor in it. So we're gonna make some lemon thyme compound butter. This is great on the, on the Thanksgiving dinner table. And I'm gonna show you how to do it now so that all you have to do at Thanksgiving is take it out of the freezer. And you can do it with a whisk. You can do it with a mixer. I just choose to do it this way because it's a little easier. And the butter goes in, and I'm going to turn this on for just a couple of minutes. So I can knock all the dishes over in the kitchen. Okay, that started to cream up just a little bit. Now, if you haven't seen time, this is what time looks straight off the plant. And those little tiny leaves are what we want. And you can pull them backwards down the stem. These little guys that have a really tiny stem, you don't have to worry about. But you can do this and take that top little section off. And then the rest of it's a little wooden, so you can do real well doing it backwards. I'm going to show you one more time. One more time. Never mind. Um, here's several stocks together. And I'm going to just pull them all backwards. And then the stems are great in your stock pot for later. All right. So I've got, oh, 20 or 30 stalks of thyme here. And we'll throw the thyme in. I've got the zest of a lemon. Throw the zest in. And then all we have to do is get that to stir up. So we put that in the bowl, scrape it down a little bit, and we'll run this in a couple minutes. I'm gonna stir that around a little bit, and now we have a very nice compound butter. And uh, you can serve it on your biscuits right next to your Thanksgiving dinner. Now this is, this is my favorite part of doing this demonstration because we're gonna make two compound butters that are ready for the Thanksgiving table or any dinner table. The trick is a one quart Ziploc bag that you can invert onto the ramekin, press it in so it's there, and then you take half this butter. Remember, we had two sticks. So half that butter goes in, and just let it pop in the ramekin like that. And then, you pull the bag up. Don't worry about getting it out of the ramekin because we're actually gonna put both of these with the plastic bag into the freezer. And tomorrow morning, that will be frozen solid and pop the butter out of the ramekin and then you can use that ramekin for the next several months until it's time for thanksgiving then you pop the ramekin out and when it's frozen it's going to hold its shape and you can take the bag off put the frozen butter back in the ramekin there you go. Two 
Compound Butters, Lemon Thyme. I'm Chef Leander, to your health.